this is a budget priced trailer that suits a lot of different uses. This trailer comes with an awning, that's an optional extra on this model. This awning is a manual awning, cranks out, very easy to operate. We've got horse ties along the side of the trailer, slide windows at the horse's butts. This trailer has got two 6,000 pound axles on it, on eight stud ST23585 R16 tyres. Aluminum rims, electric brakes on every wheel. We've also got a recharging breakaway system that charges off your hot wire out of your truck. On all Shatron slant loads, unless the customer asks for the sticking out under the oncoming traffic. Much safer than just an open window. They work very, very easy. We've also got a slide window in the drop-down window. So if it's not very hot, you can open just the slide window. Again, horse ties along the side of our windows, sides of our trailers, sorry. These diamonds, very, they add some flair to the trailer. But they're very practical, they actually stop you from scratching the side of your trailer when you're tying up all the time. You come inside. All our trailers have got solid three quarter inch rubber floor mats on extruded aluminum floor. As you can see, we've got a rubber bumper to also protect your horses when they're loading and unloading. All our dividers are on a slam latch mechanism, very easy to open. Just pull and open. As you can see, it shuts very, very easy. Our dividers are solid door core. Inside here is actually polystyrene foam with aluminum glue to the outside on both sides, and then our aluminum frame around it, all radius, all very safe for your horses. On the walls of our trailer we've got utility lining, this product is called ABF, it is almost bulletproof, you can hit it with a hammer all day, you will not break it, we've never had it broken by a horse kicking it. Behind that there is also insulation. We've got tubular head dividers, a lot more airflow than an enclosed plate one. Our pop-up roof vents, as you can see, they're actually off-centre, they're towards the horse's heads. Very important that, as you all know yourselves, if your head's cool, then your whole body's cool. So we put our pop-up roof vents to hold, towards the horse's heads to keep his head, neck and shoulders cool. If that's cool, he's cool and travels much nicer. These roof vents pop both ways, forward and rear. So if it's raining, just for ventilation, you can pop it so it's open towards the back and you won't get your horse will not get wet. Again, very, very nice. And they work very easy. We put our horse ties up high. Uh, I'm a big believer in horses need to be tied up high. You don't want them tied down low because then they can reach the floor and get into trouble. We tie our horses up high. 
Again, if a customer wants something different to that, then that is absolutely fine. Our horse stalls are standard, 42 inches wide. Again, we can make them narrower or wider to whatever the customer's recommendations are. This is the door into the living quarters. It's built like a vault. You will not break it. A lot of other manufacturers use a camper style door. We manufacture our own doors in-house. All the hinges are welded on with half inch stainless steel pins. Honestly, very, very strong. Strongest doors in the market. Now come around to the front and we'll go in through the living quarters and I'll show you. Fold down step on this trailer. All our living quarters trailers <coughs> fold down step. This step is almost 12 inches. Very, very safe for exiting and entering the trailer. This actual trailer has got the newest, latest and greatest uh, door latch on it. It's actually keyless entry. Press your key code in and it opens the door. Very good when you've got multiple people staying with you. Everybody doesn't have to have a key. Very, very nice. Also has got key entry as well. Come on inside. As you can see, very well finished trailer. We've got a hanging closet in the front with a mirror. We've got escape windows on both sides of the neck. On the windows, we've got privacy screens and sunscreens. Very nice. If you, I'll show you how the screens work here on the dinette window. So for your privacy, you just pull down this shade here. It stops people seeing what's actually going on inside. If you want it darker, then you pull down the next screen. Very, very nice. Solid wood, raised panel doors. Lots of storage in this trailer. Lots of western bling. Nice little diamonds on there and on the light shades. Again, very, very nice touch. This particular trailer has got a 13,500 BTU air conditioner and this air conditioner has also got a heat strip in it. We've got a microwave, a sink and a two-way three cubic foot refrigerator. This particular trailer has not got a cooktop. Again, it was built with the economy in mind but we can definitely fit a two burner cook top here if that's what the customer wants. A very very nice sofa and this sofa pulls down into a bed with one hand. Very easy operation. Makes a nice flat bed. The cushions come off to accommodate another couple if you're travelling with extra people. Also got a CD radio player, the antenna is everything, is on. Come into the bathroom now. This is the door out into the horses that we showed you earlier from the other side. So you've got a door into the horse area. On that door, as you'll see, we've got a full length mirror for all the ladies who make sure they're pretty when they're going out with their men. Surprising the size of the shower that we were able to fit in this 8 foot 6 short wall living quarters. It's a substantial size shower. Nicely finished. We've got a vanity. Nice little sink. And we've also got a mirrored door medicine cabinet. Again, more storage. This trailer's also got a separate toilet. I'm not a fan of the toilets in the shower, so we've done a lot of designing to make sure that everything fits. We've got a linen cupboard here. All in all, a very, very nice trailer. If you want to come outside, I'll just show you a few things extra. All our trailers come with a fire extinguisher. Outside power outlet. And around on the front of the trailer, as you can see, got our deep cycle battery in a battery box, our propane tank, spare tyre exactly the same as what's on the trailer, an aluminum rim, 
with the ST23585 R16 tyre. We also put an outside water spigot on all our living quarters trailers. This allows you to access water directly out of the tank that's in your trailer. So when you get somewhere in the middle of the night, you don't have to find a tap to water your horses to put them away. You can get some water there, or your husband or your wife can wash their dirty hands outside before they come inside. All in all, a very, very nice trailer. This trailer only weighs 6,800 pounds as it sits here today. I actually only weighed it five minutes ago. Very, very nice trailer. Thank you for your time.